hi and welcome to this video. My name is Brian Nelson from Encaustic Art Plus, based in Elsica, South Yorkshire. Hi, welcome to this video. Today I'm going to introduce you to the compact hot plate. I'm also going to introduce you to some of the tools that are available to use in conjunction with this tool. Here's a set of sponges. Again, made by Encaustic Art International. Um, and there is four sponges in total in this bag although on the video it may look like three I'll make it apparent when I open them you've got this white block that is like a hard dense rubber sponge put that on there you've got the same material in a circle but if you push the middle of it out you've actually got four sponges because you've got a small one and a donut and then you've got this little beast this is a lovely sponge and the the more wax that gets on this sponge the better it becomes um, so when you've got it dirty don't throw it away keep it the great um, there it's like a I don't know it's like the spongiest um, springy sponge like foam um, and that's what that is so that's one set of tools I just want to quickly introduce to you available again from from my uh, stores and um, be it in person or online next I'm just going to introduce you to this uh, this rubber triangle comb with three different edges on it so by Encaustic Art the original available from my shops I'll uh, whip that out of the bag so we'll have a play with that in a bit it's one of those so it's quite a hard plastic and these bits all move I'll have some fun with that in a bit quickly introduce you to another rubber tipped tool these are set, sold in sets of five scrapey tools um, again in Caustic Art branded available from my website great tools uh, the minute they retail at £18 for the set of five, that could change over the time. These are a set of paintbrushes, again with five in the set. These aren't heated but are great to work with your hot plate. Again available from my store, online as well as physical. One last product uh, introduction for today are these two rubber tipped brushes uh, one with a nice smooth edge and one with some teeth um, they're uh, 50 millimeters in width and again Encaustic Art branded great little tools again these are available from the store I'm just gonna make some patterns using some of these tools I'll explain as I go as to what I'm using and how it works so I'm just gonna put a layer of clear wax on the hot plate Again, using some A5 card. Stick that down. Apply some clear medium 27 to the card. Then I'm just going to choose some colours. This nice green 45 I think it is yeah 45 in fact I'll have that all over And initially you're thinking, hmm, Brian, you've created a bit of a mess there. We'll start with this triangle comb we introduced earlier. The triangle comb has three different comb widths. You just take it, 
and drag it through the wax, twisting it. Nice abstract pattern. Can add more colour to the picture. We start dragging the comb around, just moving it in different ways. Quite pleasing. Do some going the other way. few narrow ones Just trying to get rid of that puddle of wax in the middle if it creates you a problem just get a bit of tissue Mop a bit of it out. If you decide you don't like your picture, you can always just take a bit of tissue, wipe over the whole lot lightly. You've still got some of that wax there. You can add, apply more wax, put some yellow. Anything you want, really. Blue in that corner. Green up here. Let's let the block warm up a little bit. Red colour in the middle, just let your block warm up a little bit. I'm going to use the orange one. the letters too big didn't fit never mind we can sponge it out again that's quite a nice pattern go back to our comb drag through a couple of times add more colour you can always just use the edge of the block and just draw with it in a similar sort of a way
quick plate and a compact hot plate making abstract patterns using the comb and wax blocks. Happy painting everyone and we'll look forward to seeing you all in our next video. Please hit like and subscribe.